What is up guys, it is Noobcast101 with a special tutorial for you today. So what we're going to be having a look at is how to install Optifine, Zan's Minimap and Damage Indicators through Minecraft Forge. This will work for 1.6.4 or 1.6.2, any versions in the 1.6 and also including any version in 1.7. So let's jump straight into this. So first of all, you want to download Minecraft Forge. Just type Minecraft Forge files in and it will bring you up straight to the download section. So in Minecraft Forge, you'll then pick 1.7.2, which comes up on the side here. You want to click the recommended button because it is the most stable build. So you want to install the installer, or yes, because that will install it if you've got 1.7.2 already downloaded. So let's wait for this to go, and there we go. Next, you want to do is damage indicators. So you just type in damage indicators, that's perfectly fine. And you just scroll down just a little bit further past the picture and download the version you're looking for. While this is loading, let's jump into Optifine. Optifine download, you don't have to go straight to the page and it takes you straight to the download section. Let's give that a little bit of a load as well. And Zand Minimap, which is the final one which we'll be looking at. So once you get that in, you just go Voxel Maps. It doesn't matter if it's 1.7.10, it's still got the rest of the versions in there. So let's go ahead, jump right back to another one and start downloading. Up to find any version you want. I prefer the standard HD, so let's get that right here, and download. Auto installer, yes that's what we want, and we'll keep that file. So now this a voxel map page is opened up, this is a little bit tricky. You don't want to click download voxel map for light loader. This is, you want to go down a little bit further and you get your older versions here. So there's your 1.7.2 which is what I will be downloading here. Go back to our Optifine, skip the ad and let's download it. And this one as well. Perfect. So let's give this a moment and we'll keep these files. So while that's doing its work, let's go back and I'll show you how to install it. So if you go over into Finder, you will come up with all my files to start off with. From there, you would like to navigate down to Downloads and locate the, fi locate the files that you will be using. So right here I've got Damage Indicators, Forge, Voxel Map, and the other one which will be coming down in a moment. So what you want to do is you want to get Voxel Map, uh, not Voxel Map, you want to get Minecraft Forge, that's the one you want to start off with. And double click it and it will want you to open it. If it says that it's not by a, um, a developer that is known, just simply right click it and click open with Java. So you want to install the client here and click OK. So there we go, it is successfully installed. So if we go over to our Minecraft, which is just over here, and we go Forge, edit profile, and it should be 1.7.2 Forge. It may look like I have to reboot it. Let's go ahead and quickly reboot Minecraft Launcher here. There we go. Giving it a quick load here. Let's check if the other one's ready to download. Yes, it is, and we will download it now. That should be it. Just keep it, all of those files just to be case, just to be safe. It stops them from downloading until you accept it. And we want Forge. Just check that's the right version, and it is down the very bottom here. Done. Okay. Save profile. So next, just to be safe, just give it a quick launch. Make sure all the 
all of it's running, so it, and you also get the mods folder, which we'll be dropping the next few in. Back in 1.6, you may have realized Optifine was hard to install, but now they have made it compatible with Forge, and it's just a drag and drop, and it works. Okay, so it's just about loaded. There we go. Quick game. Oh, don't want that page. So let's get our whole um, finder back open. It's already open, and we want to open up a new page. So from the new page, we can then just make it a bit smaller so you can see it on. You could go to library if you've got it down the side. If not, you could do shift command G or go and go to folder and type in the folding. I'll put it in the description below just in case if you don't get it where the keys are on the board. So we just go to this folder here. I want to go to application support, Minecraft, mods. So within the mod folder, you want to throw your Optifine, your damage indicators, your voxel map, and that is all you need for today. Okay. So now we're able to just launch Minecraft again. Quick load, come on. You could do it for us. And we'll click play. So this should have all of your mods installed. It hasn't thrown any error messages yet, which means we've done it correctly. If you've got any problems with this, just post it in the description below and I'll be getting right back to you as soon as I can. Shouldn't take more than a um, couple of hours for me to get back to you. So, 1.7.2, perfect, so it's the right version. Mods, Optifine, Forge Mod Loader, Forge Mods, Damage Indicators, and Voxel Map. So let's quickly go ahead, jump right into a world. Just come to testing. And let's make it a bit bigger. Actually, maybe not. And perfect. Looks like everything is working so far. Let's just go ahead and show that the other one is working. Actually, we'll just do a normal mob. So let's hide that message there. So you've got your map up the top right here. You've got your Optifine. If I find the right key, yep, there it is. There's your Optifine. And also, finally, last of all, let's get our... Show off the damage indicators. Spawn the villager. Perfect. So that is it, guys. I'll leave it off right here. I hope you've understood this as much as I have. If you've got any problems, just put it in the comments down below. And thanks for watching.